is up you guys um today is an impromptu vlog i was not planning on picking up the camera today but today we're actually sorry for the bumps you can tell we're in the car um we are actually on our way to liberty state park in jersey city um we are going to just like take pictures and look at nyc from liberty state park across the river so i thought i'd take you guys along um it's about an hour from where we are so you know it seems like a lifetime for a baby so I just wanted to like take you along on the road trip and show you some of the things that I brought to keep Lennox company um, we're only doing like a half a day we're not gonna spend the whole day so um, I didn't bring a whole bunch of stuff we did pack a cooler with like drinks and things I'll show you guys but I have Lennox here with me we're on our way can you say hi Aww. Got uh, Lennox's bike with, right? We're gonna let you ride your bike. Yeah. We want to get pictures of him, but in order to keep him like preoccupied, we brought his bike so that, um, you know, he has something to do while we're taking pictures. He just doesn't have to stand there, which we know is impossible with a toddler. All right, so let me flip the camera around and I'll show you some of the things that I brought. So I brought this book this electronic book for Lennox um, he's had it since he was one he got it as a gift for his first birthday but it just sings like songs he doesn't play with it too much in the house but in the car when there's nothing else to do I figured um, you know he could take a look at it it has some of these actions where like you can flick the dish run away with the spoon you can press these buttons here I'll see if I can find it to link it but it's from VTech. And then I try and bring something that he doesn't see often. So sad. I thought that I brought him these little cars that he doesn't get to see often so that he could um, play with them. It's like something new that he doesn't see often, but I think I left them at home. So I have to keep him entertained in other ways, but that's okay. I brought his sippy cup and don't judge me, some fruit loops to keep him preoccupied. Goldfish, I brought him C-A-N-D-Y. And then we just have a cooler for ourselves. You can see, there's like banana, yogurt. We just bring like a bunch of different snacks. We go on these trips often. Um, so yeah, it's just great when you have a baby. Brought is uh, this camera that we have, we got it before Lennox was born. I don't use it for my YouTube videos, but I do use it to take pictures. Um, and then it came with an extra set of lens that's a little bit longer. So we're definitely going to use this to take pictures of him there. One thing I recommend on road trips is bringing a plastic bag because you can put trash in it. If you need to put diapers in it, it comes in handy. Something as simple as a plastic bag. So that's a tip I have. Lennox heard me talk about, you're dancing? Dance. Dance, dance. Good job. Um, Lennox heard me talk about Fruit Loops, so he automatically wanted to try some. So I had to pause the video for a second. Lennox got his new sneaks on that I showed in the Marshalls Hall. Look at these Reeboks. They're so cool. Look at that truck. Truck. The trucks and cars keep him preoccupied as well. So that's one of the perks of being a boy. Look, Nagy, or having a boy, I should say. Lennox is enjoying seeing all the airplanes. So I'll take you guys along once we get to Liberty State Park, but we are almost there. It's perfect for Lennox. Oh yeah?
guys we have made it i am so excited here we are um i think i'm more excited than lennox there's helicopters here and i know he loves helicopters so every time i see one i like have a heart attack because i know he's gonna have a heart attack so yeah we're here we're gonna go explore i'm taking you guys along like i said so let's see what there is at liberty state park helicopter. lennox is gonna die look at the helicopter my goodness, oh, it's huge. Look how close it is. Lennox, Alatoto. Oh my, say hi, we part of the helicopter. Say hi, Alatoto. When you can act. <gasps> I'm so excited you got to see a helicopter. Lennox, you see it, go get it. Go get the helicopter. He just like is so happy and makes me happy. Look at the sailboat, Lennox. Out there. Look at it. What do you see? Water. water, yeah, there is a lot of water. Many, many water. water. Look at that one. There's another helicopter, Lennox, right there. This one's a little further away. Hey, another helicopter's coming for Lennox. You'll see it behind us. Here it comes. Big, big helicopter. Look. Are you excited? That's good. Yeah, where is it? Where is it? Do you hear it? You hear it with your ears? You see it with your eyes? See it with your eyes? There it is. There it goes, right above the city. Pretty cool. But it's all the way down there. Like, Is it? All the way down. Like, all the 
right here, this building right here, is the One World Observatory Center. Um, my husband and I went there like a few days after we got married. Uh, that's like my favorite observatory tower. And they have like a little restaurant with beers. We did like a flight. It was so amazing. But once things open back up, I would recommend going right here. Really like it. And then I want to show you over in this area, they have like this memorial, these two walls. And then they have a list of like all the names of people who passed away um, during 9-11. And then my husband tells me that when you look through the walls, is where you would have seen the two towers here on the other end. So I want to show you those quick. So right here they're massive and then when you look through is where you would have seen the twin towers. So look how long it is. There's some people in here and then they call it Empty Sky. This is the September 11th Memorial. And here's a list of names of people who passed away. So when you look through here is where you would have seen the Twin Towers standing and now they have an observatory tower. So that's that. Uh huh. Whoa! Outside of the memorial, uh, empty sky memorial, are beams from the World Trade Centers. So they have this also outside of the two walls. I wanna say that you do not have to pay for parking here, which is really nice. You just have to cross your fingers that there is parking available. I believe right here, isn't this where you can pay to take the ferry? Right here, this building, you can uh, take the ferry to go across. When I went last, it was like 750 each way. So you just pay like $15 round trip which is really good. You see it? So before I had kids, I didn't think that you could wear sneakers to be dressy, but now that I have a kid, it's the only thing that's comfortable. So here's a tip. If you want to dress up an outfit, put on white sneakers if you're going somewhere. I've had these for two years and literally you, I dump bleach on them, throw them in the washer with more bleach and they turn out looking like this. So there's a fun trip for moms who want to kind of look cute. <laughs> All right, guys, that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Thumbs up if you enjoy the content. Until next time, we'll see you later. Bye, guys.